Hey, Rebecca McGrain here, and I'm going to show you how to use my favorite pitcher that inevitably leaks in everybody's home, and then when they come over and they have iced tea at my house, they don't understand because my pitcher doesn't leak, and we use the exact same pitcher. There's nothing wrong with it. There's just a little trick to getting the cap on so that the seal uh, gets set in there that just just so. So this is the, the pitcher that I use, and I'm going to do it three times for you to show you. And basically what you want to do is you want to take the lid to it and kind of just sit it around on there. You'll hear it, it'll click down. You hear that? And then turn it and tight. And you'll be able to tell that it's the right way because everything will line up. All right, so I'm gonna do it again. Not like that, which is how I see most people when they try to push it down. Don't, don't do that. Take the lid, turn it around, It'll pop down for you. Just hear that? Here's number two. One more time. Obviously, we go through about three gallons of home brewed decaf, uh, naturally sweetened iced tea a week. Oh, I'm gonna make sure you hear that again. Okay, so now for the test to show you that they really honestly don't leak. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over to my sink and I'm gonna pour with the lids closed. Notice, no leaks, no drips. Here's the first two that we did. Again. No leaks, no drips. And the last one. No leaks, no drips.